Before we start, a couple of things. I live in Thailand, so there's crickets in the background. Sorry if you hear that. It happens one time a day. And I'm recording my vlog tomorrow, so y'all will see, you know, the face reveal, but it's really not that big of a deal. I just like to show people what I actually do over here with a bunch of one championship fighters, UFC fighters, so that'll be cool. But getting on to the video, George Pickens, say it with your chest. He said he's the best wide receiver in the whole world. He said that whenever he doesn't get the ball and gets frustrated, because let's be real here, wide receivers, they get frustrated a lot. Some of them show it better than others, but it happens. He goes out and takes out his frustration when he's blocking. And that's the most savage thing that you can do. Imagine getting frustrated George Pickens lining up right across from you. That's a bad day at the office. See, this is what I love about GP. He's an all-around wide receiver. And it's actually funny because I had posted a video like four or five days ago, maybe six, seven. I've been posting a lot lately, but it said George Pickens is about to take over the NFL or destroy the league, right? And I was like, hey, he has the potential to be the best wide receiver in the NFL. Why not? Like Jamar Chase and George Pickens and Justin Jefferson were both dominating on the highest level of college football and they were all considered like the highest level of talent. What changed? Like George Pickens is still that level of talent. He just had an injury, unlucky, and didn't have the circumstances that Justin Jefferson or Jamar Chase had his first year in the league. So I would ask the people questioning that, why can't George Pickens be the best? I mean, half of the videos that are coming out of Steelers training camp are just George Pickens scoring touchdowns and GP and KP already had that connection last year but it just seems to be a lot stronger this training camp now that they've had that full off season so i'll just say this now if nobody else will but i feel like george pickens will be wide receiver one at some point in the season now I will acknowledge Deontay Johnson as wide receiver one for now because I've made the mistake in the past of saying Chase Claypool was wide receiver one after his first year, but you can never discredit what Deontay Johnson has done and he deserves that respect. But week 14, we're probably going to be seeing GP as wide receiver one, hopefully if the entire league, because I think that he can put up some crazy numbers, but we're just going to have to wait and see. Once again, let me know what y'all think about George Pickens. Can he be the best wide receiver in the NFL? Hopefully y'all enjoyed this video though, and that is it for me on this one. Peace.